It's not quite New Year's Day, but why not make your New Year's resolution early and decide to become more environmentally sustainable? Yeah, John Martin yesterday, our New Year's resolution expert, he was dancing with Cabaret, now hanging out with Jamie Beckett from Bear Creek Nature Center with more Johnny. Good morning. Good morning, Justin and Kristen. Absolutely. This is Jamie. Jamie is from Bear Creek Nature Center. Uh, you're, you're literally just told me like 30 seconds ago, by the way, you're about to get dirty, so go ahead and roll up your sleeves. So yay to that. First of all, Jamie, thank you for being with us. Let's talk about Bear Creek Nature Center. You guys are, are, are such an important part of the community over on the west side. Um, you guys just had like the candlelight walk. 550 people showed up mm -hmm. or more. Yeah. They really, really enjoy what you guys are doing over there. Why do you think it's such an important part of the neighborhood? Well, it's a free facility, yeah. and so families can come uh, Wednesday through Saturday from 9 to 4, and they can enjoy the exhibits that we have inside that talk about nature, wildlife, plants, and then we have trails outside that you can take walks on. It's just a great spot to, um, to get outside and kind of connect back to nature and kind of get away from um, the hustle and bustle. So it's just nice that it's, it's free and you can come enjoy the Nature Center at no charge. We do have programs, too. Yeah, and absolutely. And you feel like you're so far away from the city and you're, you're, little, I mean, you're just around the corner mm -hmm. from it. Talking about programs, you have a sustainability series coming up on, uh, on January 17th, which is why we have this bucket of worms <laughs> in front of us. Yes. First thing I noticed when, I, when you brought this and I thought, oh, man, you're going to open this up and just clear the room out because it's going to smell It doesn't terrible. smell at all. Smell it, does, it. It, 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 smells like, it smells like earth. It smells like earth. Yeah. Why are we talking about worms when we're talking about sustainability? Well, this is just something really easy that you can do at home. This fits underneath my kitchen sink. Um, this is a way to reduce the amount of like vegetable and fruit scraps that go into the, wa or into the landfill. Right. So one third of the landfill waste is food waste from the United States usually. So this is a way to reduce that. Wait, let's say that again. One third <clears throat> of the waste in landfills is, is just throwaway food. Yeah, right. That's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Okay, so now what you can do here is when you have the food, you have the worms, how does it all kind of work together and, and, and what... What results from putting the food in with the worms? So what they do is they break down the food scraps and they turn it into um, nutrients that you can put back into your soil. So the reason why this is sustainable is because you're taking something that would just be thrown away and be wasted in the landfill and you can actually use that to um, increase the, the nutrient soil in your garden or um, in your you know potted plants at home. I believe you're saying worm poo. Worm poo, yeah. Worm, worm castings. Worm I'm castings. sorry, we're trying to be uh, highbrow <laughs> here. Worm castings. So there's there's a lot of other stuff going on in here. I know Byron has been kind of putting the camera in here. You have a lot of sprouts. You have a lot of what? 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 What is going on in this world of dirt? Well, I mean, I didn't put any new food scraps in here because I didn't want it to be too gross when we're looking at it. But this is just all leftovers. Like this is an avocado shell. Um, things are growing in here, so obviously it's nutrient rich. You put leaves in here. So there's a, a special ratio of food and then dry stuff that you put in here. And you're going to learn all this in the sustainability workshop. All right. And we're going to come back and talk more about that is the Bear Creek Nature Center 2015 Sustainability Series. First one happening on January 17th from 1030 to 1130. You guys, every time you do any sort of project or any sort of thing, it, it seems to fill up. So if you're going to, to sign up for this, you need to call 719-520-6387. I don't know That's why right. I just didn't have you say that instead of me <laughs> looking down at a piece of paper. So again, it's the 2015 Sustainability Series. Go see Jamie. She, it, it, she makes it educational and entertaining. I assure you, you're going to walk away going, well... Well, now I'm inspired to be sustainable. <laughs> so we're going to come back in the 8 o'clock hour talk more about worms. Oh, I know worms are a good thing here. Yeah, but so I'm, uh, I'm, I'm ready for it. Okay, that, good, buddy. Go. I appreciate it. Thanks, uh, Jamie, for being here as well, and John, for showing us that really cool thing. That's yeah, a great, great cool. program, too.